Oh, hi there, and welcome back to the Henry Stickman collection of Stealing the Diamond Episode 2. Y'all, if y'all remember watching my episode 1, you'll remember how goofy and fun that this series is, and we shall continue this goofy fun series. I hereby declare the Tunisian archaeological exhibit I need it. I need that diamond. So there's one thing that I missed and I, I completely just forgot about it and I was reminded about it in the comments of the first episode, which was you actually can choose disguising bag as an option and it is an ending and I didn't know that. So yeah, let's present the money bag as evidence. Is that the bag the defendant hid in? Yes, but there's one thing that's been bothering me. If the defendant really was hiding in this bag, then how did he tie the knot from the outside of the bag? What? If he was inside the bag, it'd be impossible for him to tie that knot on the outside. But then, how did he do it? It's simple. That he makes, didn't. that actually like, <gasps> low-key makes sense. Saying? But at the same time, like, hiding that bag at all. how, how he did he tie him. that knot? <laughs> was it a pre-knotted bag? <laughs> As you can see by this doctor's analysis, the defendant had taken quite the beating. While he was in the bag, he was unconscious. I, I have absurd. no memory of this. The witness was attempting to dispose of the body. He left the defendant in the bag, knowing he'd drive by it on the way back to the bank. When the witness and his partner passed the bag, oh. he used his partner to throw the bag in with the others. But, but why would he do that? Why, to dispose of the body, of course. There are millions of bags of money in that bank. And That's the genius. Long time before the victim was found. That's my lawyer. That's my witness, lawyer. Stick him in Phoenix right. To from his tomb. That's my lawyer. I, if I... Get arrested for something. I need Stickman Phoenix now. right. You can't, you can't, you, you can't be happy to me. <laughs> oh my. Well, that certainly was an interesting trial. Yeah, I'm for sure. For my verdict. I find the defendant, Henry Stickman. Let's go. That's what we're talking about. I'm so upset that I missed this. I need the diamond. Exactly. Thank you, Henry. We need this diamond, and I'm not feeling sneaky. We're busting in. That's right. Busting in. Who cares? I don't... People don't... If they know I'm here, I'm gonna have a diamond the size of me that weighs more than anything. All right? They ain't gonna have a chance. I'm gonna be rich millionaire. Ooh, jump. I, I, <laughs> I thought the vendor was gonna jump with the... With the scooter and not jump off the scooter. Uh, ram. Yeah. Oh, I went through the doorway. What about the other guy? Oh, bio, bio, bio. Yes. Uh, oh, I forget. I gotta collect all the cards. Oh, snap. You hear that dubstep? Lance. That's right. Oh, okay. That's Sparta. <laughs> the reference is there. Oh, man. I'm sorry. I feel like I'm in high school again. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah, shield. Give me that diamond. The rare diamond. Uh, 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 basket. Basket. Okay. Obviously, the basket was not a good choice. I thought the tow cable would be a bad choice. I thought we would maybe lose something if we tow it. And that no, it's working just fine. Him. Whoa, really? Yeah, that's when I decided I should probably get a different job. I figured night garden is much less dangerous than driving it. Crap. <laughs> the lore. Look at that. We're alive with a diamond. Oh, branch, branch, branch. I didn't mean to get shot. All right. I forget there's QTEs in this game. Branch. That's right. <laughs> Wait. I didn't think he was going to like go of the scooter i thought he was gonna have a hold of the scooter and then uh, i didn't think that went through i guess oh snap we got two stars rock he'd be dead he'd be so dead not gonna lie oh, oh bubble bubble it's working I can't believe it. It worked. I thought the bubble wasn't going to work, honestly. We got to jump that. We got to jump that bridge. Sir, place your hands where I can see them. If you do not comply, I will be forced to fire upon you. And kick the diamond. <laughs> yeah. 
Come on, that's got to get us away. Do we get away, way? That's what we're talking about. <laughs> Shooter on a scooter. Let's go. <laughs> okay, we got to go through and we got to see all the failures for the uh, running gun. So we got to see what happens if we if we get all the other fails. So this is what our kick. The kick. What's the, the kick is the same as the ram in my opinion. So what if we don't do anything? Dude, the dubstep's insane. Bro, who puts a boat like... Well, okay, actually. Makes sense. Makes sense. It's a museum. All right, we don't do anything. I love the memes in the background. This really ages the game when you see the memes in the back. So, it, it's pretty great. Okay, uh, if we don't do anything. Put your hands up, boy. Don't do the muscle. Fair. Makes sense. Fair. All right, sticky grenade. I always had that question like growing up whenever you had plasma grenades and like halos like why wouldn't they stick to you first? Um, why would they or sticky grenades in general? Wave goodbye to your head, waker. <laughs> Man's just got sniped. Hey, boom, headshot. Yeah, buddy. I, I always had that question and then one of my friends was like, well, I, there's the science of the, the, sti the particles of a plasma grenade don't become sticky or magnetized to you until after you release it because there's a trigger. And I'm like, that's too much nerd work. My brain hurts. Your hands where I can see them. Uh, what if we drive? <laughs> the subtle explosion. Sir, the subtle explosion. Them. Bribery is a federal offense, sir. I'm just saying, I take that diamond. Officers, I'm innocent, I promise. No choice, sir. Dang. We're sneaking in. Uh, I like... The, you know what? We gotta do it. Let's, let's try the teleporter. We have to try it. Eventually, it will work, right? I mean, we made it. <gasps> it worked! Oh my gosh! <laughs> Falcon Punch, let's go! <laughs> he quick with it. Yeah. What about a penny? What about a penny? I can't believe that worked. I cannot believe that worked. You know what? Honestly, that probably would work for me. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. Portal gun. <laughs> Snap. <laughs> <laughs> why did it why did it minimize what do you do what are you doing henry stickman is so powerful it crashed my pc can't handle henry stickman all right the portals were so powerful it crashed my game so you know we back we back here we dropped in okay that makes sense that that wouldn't work a wire yeah, fair. A wire would work. I, that, I have no... Hammer. <laughs> would that work? Why would that work? <laughs> oh! <laughs> um, cheese? I don't know. I thought the cheese would like turn me into a small rat or mouse or something. I need uh, 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 the cannon. Shoot, shoot me with the. Uh -oh, uh -oh, uh -oh, uh -oh, uh -oh. I thought I was gonna shoot the diamond and take his head off. I honestly, mm, that's a good freaking door, by the way. That's a really good door. And after that, they just up and arrested him. Whoa, really? Yeah. How does that work? I really can we jump the drop the diamond on him? Can we just drop the diamond on him? Oh, I feel so bad. Oh, I feel so bad. Oh no. I didn't think that would work. I didn't think it would work. Okay, okay, okay. Let's let's see what happens if we try to snap his neck. He looks like a rough and gruff. Butterfingers. <laughs> the Butterfingers. <laughs> Trying to steal his rifle. A man's didn't take any classes on how to uh, properly use and aim that weapon. <sighs> uh, 
Yeah, I agree. I wasn't even thinking about that, honestly. All right, what's the way you lose the laser cutter? The thing that should be sneaky and stealthy. The tranquilizer. Does it ricochet? <laughs> he did. I thought it was going to like ricochet off the door, not go through the air vent and get you. I, <laughs> that's good. Like, that's classic. Like, oh, yeah, the ricochet. Imagine if there was such a thing as an invisibility pill. Like, what do you mean? What, you shouldn't lose track of me. You're the narrator. Like, what the heck, bro? Okay, so... We have an option to go straight through the, the wall as well as going up. Let's just, we know these two are going to fail. Let's just see what goofiness is going to happen. Yikes. <laughs> oh, so close. Oh, so close. Imagine your knees. Imagine your knees. Like. Uh, my knees are just crying thinking about that. Okay, um, we're trying to go through that wall. Well, we use a pick. That, that makes sense. No oh, boy. Yeah, so apparently no way that worked. And, uh, he used it to escape. And then I got fired. Pretty lame, huh? How, How come all like the prison the guards are, sec are security here? Shut what up. the mess is uh, this? I just, I just, I just what do you mean? How did the creeper work? Fair. <laughs> fair, fair. Okay, what about a plane? What about a plane? Uh, I gotta warn some. Gotta go through the. <laughs> oh, you're finally awake. <laughs> Retro room? Continue forward. I can't believe that the, that the creeper or the pick was the correct answer. All those video game references, by the way, in that last room. Look at them. Bruh. They're... Good ball. Straight up. It's going to work. Tim and Joe. Oh, that's tough. That's tough. Got a scuffed, got a scuffed Pokemon. I feel like this is a bad idea letting an alien out. Isn't that a head hopper from uh, from Half Life? Were they aliens or were they creatures? I can't remember. That's fine. I feel like this is a bad idea. Oh. Oh, are we popping off? Is this going to work? Why did it pterodactyl? That's terrifying. That's terrifying. The idea of a pterodactyl just suddenly emerging from a, uh, its egg. Center for chaos containment. Chaos control. Uh, sir? You might want to come look at this. I'm getting oh, that reminds me of the game Don't Touch the Button, it's coming from the museum. Um, right, or something like that. Yeah. Oh, that was such a good game. Over nine. Yeah, I'm leaving this decision up to you, Corporal. 9,000. He, he didn't do the whole thing. He, he's Come playing on, with us. Oh. Oh? Call of Duty reference, Modern Warfare 2 reference, the tactical nuke inbound reference. My man's like, things are out of control, nuke them all. That's that's the solution. Uh, I divide by zero, is that what that is? Uh. 
Isn't there like some mathematics out there where it's just false math where they say you can divide by zero and you're like, oh, what are you? That, that, this seems like a good choice. The dubstep. We like the dubstep. Man, I, I remember when Dubstep made its <laughs> made its debut. Let's go. Do we get away with it? Or do we just run away? What does Chaos Control Centers have to do with Henry trying to steal a diamond? Is it just too dangerous? The lore will make sense in future Henry Stickman uh, parts, by the way. Oh, look at that. Yeah, baby. Just playing that. <laughs> Heck yeah, I am. Oh my. Yeah, Ant-Man things. How are you gonna grow bigger though if you drop the... Lisa Nakaib! Lisa Nakaib! Hi! <laughs> Dune reference? <laughs> oh my. Liquid, that sounds horrifying. That sounds absolutely horrifying. Or is it just giving me time to... Oh, that just... Oh, that just reminds me of the start of... Of, um... <laughs> of the X-Men movie. The live-action X-Men movie. With the, the, the governor or whatever. The president... No, no, no. There's like a governor that... Gets turned into a mutant against his will. And he just turns into water. Ugh, that scene always scared me as a child. Um, hit him with the... With the... Bo my man, he's been practicing his quick draw. <laughs> what if I do nothing? What's the conversation? That's awkward. It's just... It's just awkward. That reminds me trying to make friends. Crowbar. That's the choice. Totally not the choice. There's the head hoppers. There's the head hoppers from Half Life. Okay, so the aliens. I don't know what the alien reference is from. Is that, is that like Samus or something like that? What does the satellite do? It caused my game to crash. <laughs> no. Oh my gosh. I'm a fire in my laser. Well, that's it for episode two of Stealing the Diamond. The next episode, we are going to be looking at infiltrating the airship. This is where things really start kicking off, where a lot of the references are just like crazy and my most memories are from the airship the wall and then the final big you know finale of this amazing saga whatever you want to call it uh but i really hope that y'all enjoyed this episode of the henry stickman collection of episode two where we uh stole the diamond next we have to get the ruby and maybe an emerald eventually but don't forget i love you all and you're blessed be the best people that y'all can be